te tautara ta kuhiwi ko ahi titi. Ko tahu au pihima taku ingoa, uh, ko ahi titi te maunga, ko ahi hirere te awa, uh, ko parihimani hi te marae, ko ngāti wahia me ngāti kohi ngā hapu, ko tētanga maha ki te iwi. I tifu mai au uh, tūturu ki roto uh, i tēnei waku papakainga. Ko au ko ahi hirere, ko ahi hirere ko au, uh, ko tērā tētahi o ngā āhua tanga i whakatongia e aku, e aku pakeke, e aku uh, mātua, e aku kuia, e aku kraua, uh, ki roto iau. Nō reira, I can't imagine having grown up anywhere else and because of that I can't love anywhere else as much as I do and that's how I feel about this place. Growing up here, haka was a really big and I think integral part of um, life. It's been integrated so much so that you almost can't associate, you almost can't not associate what he did with haka. I wouldn't be the person that I am today without having grown up here and the lifestyle that this place and club provided um, for me and my whanau. I lived with my grandparents right up until when I was 10. And so my papa, he was the biggest person in my life. So when he passed it actually really, really affected me. If I hono nga anu wau ki aia, um, ma te moko kauai. It's a kind of experience that you have to be wholeheartedly committed to yourself. While I was lying there and I was focusing so deep on myself that I kind of went into a space that you couldn't feel anything. <clears throat> but then this is when it became not about me. E matu, and I opened my eyes, and there's all my whanau, all there to support me, and that's when it became, it was about me, but it became bigger than, than me. I te tauru a mano te kamarima, um, i haere au, ki te rau whakamau mahara, um, ki te pakanga o eringa hika. Ka puta mai e nei, e nei kōrero, te mōhio e au te mōhio aku mātua, te mōhio aku kui aku kraua, when you're in that situation, you sit there and you think to yourself, why don't I know this about myself? And so, whaimuri te rai huio a ki ngā mahita o ngā kura tuarua, and I said, what can we do as a group of people who have the power to do something to change that? The biggest reason I started this kaupapa is because I didn't want my younger siblings or my children or my uri whakaheke to sit at a commemorative day again and feel exactly the way it, that I felt. Guilty and ashamed that I didn't know about my own whakapapa and my own history.